Hello, beautiful people of the internet. My name is Ryan, and welcome back to our Farming Simulator 22 Let's Play series. It's episode number 42. I hope you're having a great day. It is uh, it is harvest time? It's harvest time for us. In the last episode, we did a bunch of random jobs to make $20,000, and we barely did. And in the process of that, uh, we also uh, purchased some new land. Let's go take a look at our new land. We got brand new land today. Uh, we also have some stuff to do to some... Frankly, we got some shit to clean up after the last episode, but let's go visit our new piece of land first. Uh, I guess we can visit it here and then go there. It's this way. Uh, it's the Field 51, which should have wheat in it. Oh my god, I forgot I have something to show you guys. Uh, I have something to show you as soon as we are done looking at this. It's got wheat. It, the wheat is technically growing. Aha! So we actually can't... We actually cannot harvest it today. Interesting. Our other wheat is harvestable today um that's fine i forgot i have something to show you guys which is as i was cleaning up from the end of the last episode we still have some cleaning up to do for instance we have a hay bale that was left over after our baling job uh i found after doing this little field i may or may not have spent a little bit of time looking around over here at this this little nice farmhouse and building for uh some collectibles what do you know i found it's a sheep I found a sheep. It's a collectible. I love it. I spent a lot of time here, and th that's the only one I found. So, uh, shit. I still have this thing to bring home. It's the only one I found, unfortunately. Uh, but, you know, such is life. Uh, so, it's July. We got some stuff to do. I will get us started on that in just a second. What I'm going to do first is take this sucker and send it home using a worker. Um, so, July. Get out of here which means it is harvest time for wheat and also canola. So, we got a couple things to do. Uh, yes. Yes, we do. I am going to first take this and also the header that we're going to use uh, down to the shop to get them... Uh, to get them... Save... Uh, what, do you, what do you call it? Repaired is the word. Uh, because I would like them to be 100%. So I will be right back uh, once that is done. Alrighty, we are looking dirty, but we are hopefully $1,000 there, $100 there. Hopefully we are going to harvest a little bit better because of that. All right, well, let's go get this harvest started. Oh my God, did you just notice what I noticed? Maybe you guys saw this earlier. You've been screaming at me about it for episodes, but we have... 3,700 liters of corn in this <laughs> in this combine still. Holy shit! We never took the uh, we never took the corn out of the combine. Uh, the last harvest out of the combine. I cannot go there. Um, so we're gonna have to go dump that and then uh, and then get this harvest started. Oh, buddy, we are all over the place today. Uh, I was driving home today and I noticed. Guess what I saw on the used sale? An incredible combine. An incredible combine for 56% off. I can't drive through here either. Shit. For 56% off. Maybe I could do it right here. I don't want to destroy any of this crop. I'm about to, though. <gasps> nope. I'm going to destroy my truck. Uh, For 56% off, which is incredible, Uh, it would save us 200,000 plus dollars. Uh, and yet, I cannot uh, afford it. I just can't. I, there's no way I could possibly come up with two hundred uh and forty thousand dollars even if i sold this combine i think it's worth like 40 can i just un nope can i just unfold this and pull it forward there we go beautiful um there's just literally uh no way which is such a heartbreak it's a good sign that we need to probably soon when it's time for a, a combine upgrade for us which is probably going to be a while we need to probably just walk around with two hundred and fifty thousand dollars in available loan from the bank like ready it at all times which is crazy that's a lot of money we could always put into something else but or that much money sitting in the silo uh i mean i guess that's true too but yeah that's hard that's really hard to do all right we're gonna get this uh this wheat harvest started right here and uh, then canola. We got a lot to do today. I don't know that I'm going to fit it all into an episode. Um, 
We got a lot to do today. It's probably going to be a couple different time lapses, so. Uh, let's go ahead and... Well, I don't, I'm not even going to spend the time to start and stop a time lapse. I'm just going to do a pass on either end and then hire a worker. Um, yeah, lots to do today. Lots to do today. And I think a lot of it is... A lot of it is com is harvesting, but we also have some stuff to put up. We haven't checked on our animals yet, so we got plenty we could do today. I'm glad we took the time to repair the harvester, though. I do want to get in the habit of uh, either the day before or the day of uh, harvest, uh, repairing the harvester and the header, so that if it affects uh, yield, which I think it does, I believe that it does, we should have it. Um, we should have it repaired. It's a good habit to get into. Uh, I'm going to park this, and then I think I'm going to check on the animals. We're going to keep that harvester running at all times with a worker with a worker doing it. I shouldn't have done that. I should turn around, actually. Probably. You know where I could put it? Honestly? Just do it here. Just put it, like, sort of... Oh, that's not it. Oops, that's not it. But it's sort of here, um, alongside this building. It's not directly out of the way, but... Uh, let's see here. If I can pull this off. That's not the right way. I usually do this stuff off camera because it is hard. We just pull through. That's what we should do. What we should do here is just pull through. Learn your lessons, Ryan. Just pull through. I think how I would like to do this is actually just do this. Do this. Do you think I can fit this? Let's 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 learn all together now. That's beautiful, actually. That's its new parking spot. That's pretty out of the way. Uh, okay, let's check on our our animals real quick while uh, while he is working. Uh, we also have you to unhook. So, we could do that real quick. Um, let's try this. I think there is technically still a hooked thing. What about you? Yep. Turns out there was still... <laughs> oh, that's incredible. There was still a hooked thing. Oh, that's so funny. That's absolutely wild. Uh, let's go take this over to the... Uh, to the barn where we park it. And... Uh, <laughs> it didn't look like it was hooked, but it sure as shit was. We'll check on the uh, sheep while we're out here. If we... If they need some... Hey, we'll bring them some, but... I think we got two canola fields and uh, one wheat field to get through today. And some of it to get through tomorrow, too. So. Uh, Y'all could use food, it turns out. All right, well. In that case, I think I know how to bring you some. I'm a little annoyed at how the I think that all of our fields that are wheat and canola are ready to harvest except for one and I think it is and I think it's our new field I'm a little annoyed at this uh done 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 and not done so how do I fix that so that they're all on the same time scale Wheat can't be planted until September anyways, so that actually does not matter. I can just harvest it tomorrow. Canola can be planted tomorrow. So, the canola absolutely has to be done. Uh, by tomorrow. By August. Alright, so it fixes itself, it turns out. Hello, sheepy. I have new food for you. Yep, I believe, Ryan. I believe. I believe you can do this. I believe you can do this. 
Oh, come on. There we go. It's like algebra, you know? I was never any good at algebra. But the minute your brain starts to figure it out, then you're fine. It's uh, it's waiting for your brain to figure it out the first time that it really gets you. All right, let's go check on that harvester. See how he's doing. Perfect timing, just about done. One more to go. Uh, we should have a chance here in a second to uh, check on the rest of our chickens. Check on all of our chickens. I don't even know if I've checked on those chickens. 91 chickens in here now. They're cranking. Ooh. Uh, we're going to have to keep a... Uh, we may have to buy a like forklift or something. Deal with these pallets all the time. 7,000. 8,000 or something like that. Exciting. Very exciting. We're going to have more eggs than we know what to do with. Uh, An egg time isn't until... I'm going to need to know this. I think egg time is like November or something, right? No, it's before that. November. Look at that. So this is the only wheat we are harvesting today. So let's go ahead and turn it off and dump it here. Uh, in the way of this tractor. We'll go and get this harvest done. I really am curious to see if I can figure out how to turn the, uh, look at that. Smooth, smooth move right there. See if I can turn these two canola fields into one. See if it's smart to. I'm not sure if it's smart to. Oh, I should have checked how many liters of, uh, of wheat that was. Uh, I think we can actually check here. One of these pages tells us stats, right? Uh... Stats for the day. I have 13 out of 100 collectibles, by the way. Um, it does not tell me shit. Hmm. Well, you'll be able to tell from the VOD, from the video, how much, uh, how much I had in the harvester when I dropped it off. But I do not know exactly. All right, let's. We're gonna do the base. We're gonna do the base passes first. The, uh, the passes over here along this edge. Um, so we will do all of that. Uh. And then we can hire a worker to get started. We're going to have lots of canola. Canola, canola. I just think these would make a nice a nice singular field, right? Would we have any problems if we did that? One singular field. I just got to plow that. I got to get them on the same lime rotation. Um, and then if I do some passes right here, I could I could set them vertical. Too. I could just set the workers to go vertical and uh, and it shouldn't be a problem rather than doing this sideways into the trees every time I know we'd still have to hit like you know we'd have a we'd have other fields to stop ourselves from running into but these trees on these edges and the and the slope of the ground and stuff just annoys me I don't know I don't think it matters a ton what we do here, but uh, I like the idea of doing it. For some reason it, my voice just cracked. What the hell? 29 years old. For, for some reason, for some reason it just seems, uh, it seems quicker. I don't know that it would be quicker, but it seems quicker to go vertical. Maybe it's an illusion. It's probably an illusion. Alrighty. I am excited to see how many liters. I said that we would probably bring home 50,000 liters of canola from these two fields, fully heart, fully fertilized and everything. Very interested to see. I, 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 I stick by that number. 50,000 would be awesome. 
It would be a little frustrating to not have this path through here, but that's okay. I think it'd still be worth it. The two fields line up so nicely. Uh, we are going to start... I, I was considering doing one more pass that direction and then going, but we are going to start on this end because if I can bring the trailer on this side, it works pretty well. Works pretty well. We've never filled up that trailer. Maybe today will be the day. I don't know if 50,000 liters will do it. I don't remember how much it holds. I don't know how much it holds, actually. But... All right, let's get a worker started on this. We're going to come back and finish this eventually ourselves, but we still have some work I'd like to do uh, first. So, you are going to go grab this trailer because you're definitely going to have to pull it later. Actually, we'll wait. I probably want to pull it with this thing, which is more powerful. All right, we got 30 chickens here. Um, probably want to sell a couple. Do that, and that. Uh, the other, the others are okay. So let's see here. The other chickens are okay. I already checked on them. Uh, they were fine. The sheep were fine. And do we have anything else we need to do today? I don't think so, right? Um, this was wheat and will be wheat again. So we don't need to do anything with it. Uh, does it need? Doesn't even need lined. Well, shit. Neither does this one. All right. We should probably wait to do that field together until it needs lined, huh? Uh, let me grab the trailer and take it over there. And then we're just going to have ourselves some fun uh, getting that harvest done. We're a little bit broke until that harvest is and sold, it turns out. <laughs> until that harvest uh, goes to Goldcrest Valley, we are going to be... We'll be broke until we do that, and then we'll be rich. And I don't know that we'll be rich enough to afford a new harvester, but we will be rich. Okay, uh, I really don't think that there's anything left to do today other than to harvest this. So I think what I may do, is that right? I think that's it. So uh, what I may do is time-lapse it and then we'll see from there what else to, what else to do today. I don't know. I'll, uh, I'll be right back. Okay, we are zooming, and yet we aren't that far. This is a lot of, cano uh, of canola. Whew. Uh, I think that's about as long as I would like to uh, make a time lapse, probably. And uh, we're not all that close to being done. 
we'll see when I actually make the time lapse if that's too long. I don't want to. I, I just don't want to like speed it up to three thousand percent so that you can't see anything. And I also don't want to. Uh, ooh, we're just just a little bit too wide, maybe. I also don't want to time lapse it for like sixteen minutes and or you know five minutes and make you guys sit through two separate songs. Nobody's going to watch that. I, nobody's interested in that. I'm not interested in that. I think what's important here is that you guys get the idea, right? So what I may do, I, I'm going to be harvesting canola for a while. I'm enjoying myself. I don't think you guys need to see it necessarily. Tell me if I'm wrong. You know, I can find a way to make you, to, to help help you all watch it if you really, really would like to. Um, but I think what I'll do is just harvest it. And I'll cut back when I'm done. You know? Or... or and or, you know, if I have anything to say in between. But um, otherwise, I think I might just do it. You know? I think that works. We're at that stage. The farm is growing. What can I say? The farm is growing. We're, uh... We have that, that trailer is 35% full. And by the time we're done with this field right here, I think it will be at about 50% full. So I think we may actually overrun that trailer. Uh, you know, with these two fields, which is incredible. Uh, these two fields are going to be such a godsend to us in terms of money. Like, if we can get... Let's do the math here, right? 52,000 uh, times... What do we sell it at? 2,300? Fifty. If we save about 50,000 liters, I think, at 2,300 per liter, uh, that's 100 and something, 106,000 um, dollars. So... Yeah, every one of those is a new... F every canola har you know, harvest here is then a new field or close or halfway to a new fucking combine because these combines are expensive, um, I think. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, we. I mean, I, I don't... I want to do it, and I'm so happy that this canola exists. I just don't think I need to show you guys every time. So, I want to I wanna respect your time and show you guys things that are interesting. So, here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna show you when I'm done, or I'll see you soon, or something like that. BRB. Okay, we are wrapping up. I'll be honest, I'm not wrapping up. A worker is wrapping up. I have used this time to answer YouTube comments and work out some other stuff and refill all of the all of the greenhouses with water and etc. It's been good time, actually. I think this is gonna be smart of us to, uh, to not run the entirety of uh, of these fields by myself. I like running them. I like getting a taste for it. And now we can have workers do it while I answer YouTube comments and stuff. Uh, we're not going to have as much canola as I thought. I'm bummed. I think we'll be like 40, 4,300, something like that. 4,200, 4,100. Sorry, 42,000. Something like that. Uh, I don't know why I came down here when he will be down here. Ooh. It's hardcore lacked. Um, I think part of that is because I didn't count the other field. We usually have around 26,000. That's this field to our left, uh, 41, and also the field over by home. 41's a little bit bigger than 42. So maybe that one's like 22,000 or something. 20, something like that, and then we had another field for 4,000. This one is maybe maybe 20,000, maybe 18,000, something like that. Liters? I don't know. Yeah, we're gonna be at, we're gonna be at like 40, 40,000. So that's a little bit of a bummer. Um, that means a little bit less money than I thought, but it's still gonna be plenty. It's still gonna be almost 100,000 if we sell it at the right time with the right price, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So just gotta keep an eye on that price. Uh, overall, I think that's it for this episode. In the next episode, we're going to go harvest 51 uh, and do a bunch of work on 51, which is exciting because it's our next, our next, our next new field. This worker's done. So let's, uh, let's add all of this together and just see what we have. We can dump it in the uh, silos so that we know all, all together what we have. We've also never seen this trailer quite so full. It's not going to be completely full, but... Oh, shoot. I'm running it the wrong direction. There we go. Trying to get it as full as I possibly can. Oops. All right. So, what is it? 
Let's see. It is 94% and it's 42,000. So that's not so bad, I would say. Uh, not so bad. I'll take it. I mean, it's going to... Lord knows. It's going to finance our entire future. Every every July, we'll have 42,000 out of these two fields, so long as we keep them both canola. And that is a big deal. I got to tell you, I did spend a little bit of the time while I was looking at those workers doing the work. Just dreaming. Just absolutely dreaming here. Ugh. I mean, if we sold all this canola right now, 42 times one and a half, we'd get 80. If we let's 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 do the math. Let's do the math. Just because I I'm I'm kicking myself. If I sold all of my corn for 1.5k, we'd make four and a half. We'd make 5k. If I sold all of my wheat, which I can't even really do, we'd make 16k. So that's 21k. If we sold 42. So that's 21k. If we sold 42k liters of canola at 1.6k, that would be 70 if we're lucky, 70k. So that makes 90k. If we did that, uh and then we sold our own harvester uh, we need owned items harvester for probably, yeah, around that. That puts us at 120. <laughs> That's halfway there. It's only halfway. I'd have to sell some tractors. That's 160. We're still 100. Oh, we're still 100K off at that point. I just can't do it. I just can't do it yet. Do I have any money in the bank right now? Got 15,000 in the bank. I mean, I could sell literally everything. I could sell literally everything and make it work, but it's not worth it. It's not worth it. It'd be, it'd be making a step forward, but taking six steps back, and that's just not worth it. So what we're going to have to do instead is play the long game, and eventually we'll be driving that tractor. Sorry, eventually we'll be driving that harvester. That harvester would be a badass. It's got like 16,000. I, I can't focus on it. I can't focus on it. I'm going to have to stop. I'm going to have to stop myself. Uh, we want to go through there, actually, but, um, yeah, what I'm going to do is dump this, and I'm going to put everything away for the day, but we'll see you tomorrow for another one. Um, we'll see you tomorrow for another one. You know what else I could do? Just find every goddamn collectible that's ever existed in this game. <gasps> oh, I just gave myself a heart attack, actually. Oh, I thought I was about to actually fall in. Oh, I just actually got a sense of falling, and I don't like it. All right, that's going to do it for this episode. Thanks so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. I may film one more after this yet tonight. Uh, it depends on how quickly I get all the rest of this stuff set up and put away and all that jazz. So, uh, anyways, thanks for, the awesome, uh, thanks for the awesome support and stuff on these videos. You guys are the absolute best. We'll see you tomorrow for more farming soon. Bye-bye.